largest naval exercise in the world is underway off Hawaii. RIMPAC 2016 consists of 45 surface ships, five of them from China. But the vast majority are from the U.S., and it gives the host nation a chance to show off its power. CCTV's Nathan King reports from Honolulu. Two symbols of U.S. naval power, the aircraft carrier John C. Stennis and the much smaller, nimbler Coronado, both projecting U.S. power in the Pacific. The Stennis, 335 meters long, is the ultimate symbol of power, capable of carrying 70 aircraft and over 6,000 sailors. Just a few weeks ago, this carrier and another conducted a show of force in the South China Sea, near the Philippines, which was criticized by China. And back in April, the U.S. Secretary of Defense was aboard as it sailed near islands and features claimed by China. However, the crew says the mission was routine. And the ship goes where it goes, and um, you always see, I guess the one difference is the South China Sea is so busy, just with commercial traffic, other traffic, it's, there's always things to look at at the horizon. At. But there's nothing routine about the USS Coronado. With a crew of just 200, it's built of aluminium, very light and very fast, adaptable to any mission. It can also dock itself in very shallow waters in the South China Sea, for example. Uh, my four-year-old says it looks like a spaceship. It's actually been compared to a Ferrari, and the commander sees that comparison. Uh, speed is, like I said, a weapon on a ship like this, and uh, we use it to our advantage uh, to the max extent possible. Yeah, the Coronado also has got a shape and capability to avoid detection. Unlike an aircraft carrier, it's likely you wouldn't even see the Coronado coming. So we're on the deck of the Stennis aircraft carrier once again, the mission of American power in the Asia Pacific. But over the next few days, we're going to be showing you the Chinese ships that are here and the revolution that's happening within the Chinese Navy, bringing it fastly into the 21st century. Nathan King, CCTV, Pearl Harbor, Hawaii.